Hey guys, Kaiseri here, and welcome back to another episode on our survival server. Uh, I'm going to do two of these this week, because I want to do some progressy stuff, and not just try not to die in a hole stuff. Um, and I want to, I actually really, really want to do this over here and get this done. I want to go ahead and make a, a, a zombie spawner grinder level... Thing. Um, the thing that makes the zombies and sends them up and then drops them down <laughs> thing. So that's what uh, that's what we're gonna do today. Now I've done a lot of the the grindy dig work already so this box we've got here is a uh, 9 by 9 and I put a channel in the middle so we're gonna push them all into the middle and right here we go up and then they're gonna go forward to, uh, we're gonna have to go around. Uh, they're gonna, they actually go up there. We're gonna have to do some terraforming up there cause it's a little bit questionable looking. Let's see, right there, there it is. So that box right there, they're gonna move forward like two blocks and they're gonna fall down 20, three blocks I think it's 23 um, right here and they're gonna land uh, right here and then right here we're gonna have a little entrancey guy right here and that's where we can whack them and kill them and get all of their glorious little XP balls which is the whole idea <laughs> so uh, the first thing we're going to to need to do is grab some stone and we're just not going to talk about how many signs you see in that chest <laughs> and first thing we got to do is put um actually put in some signs because uh we need something to stop the water and yet still allow the zombies to fall. Now I've seen this design before. I don't, um, I don't remember where though. So, uh, to whoever whoever made this, I I apologize. I don't remember. <laughs> I wish I did. Okay, so that's actually gonna go to there. So then we need a sign there. And a sign there, and we're going to go ahead and put some water here and grab these guys and put a sign. Oh, not, not like that. Is it there? No. Maybe. We need more water. This is going to be interesting. I got to get out of here first. Oh, I was hoping. So, anyway, the zombies will fall down here and get pushed by that water into that hole and uh, once they are in the hole we put water there no we cannot well maybe can we what does this do okay so I actually just stopped like dead in the water let's grab this and grab this sign and grab that break this let's try something else let's just put the water right here and that does mean that zombies are gonna they're gonna stop here and they'll have to get pushed but that's okay i think Because, why isn't this working? I've done this before and it worked. <laughs> I think it worked. There should be a way where you can make the water go up. I don't remember what that is though. Hmm. Oh, maybe it's like this. Put a sign there. Put a sign there. And put water there. 
Yes, that is it. Okay, so then we want a sign. And we actually need more water. But so we're gonna go up here, it's gonna alternate. So sign, water, sign, water, sign, water. And I think we actually also need a block right there. Yes, okay. And that will force them up, um, up to the top of that thing. And then we're gonna need some water to push them back down. So let me go ahead and, because this is going to be a lot of uh, a lot of water collection, because I only brought two buckets, and I can only find three buckets, so either way it's going to take forever. Um, so let me go ahead and get this, this whole, um, we're going to take forever to put these signs in this water down, taken care of, and once I am done, I will bring you back and actually we are going to put Does that go in the right spot. We're going to put some glass right here so we can see them coming up. So I'm going to do that too. Let me get all that done and I will see you in, in just a few minutes. I am back and we have apparently lost a sheep in the making of this farm. It's a sad day. <laughs> um, not really. I was actually just just now waiting to sleep and um, like at the same time I clicked the bed, the sheep fell and I heard the little thump and it was very, it was a little weird actually, to be honest. All right. Well, back to back to the farm. Um, I don't think I have a way in currently. I have a hole. I have a singular hole. <laughs> um, but I do have the water coming all the way up here to the top. Yes. So right here. And then this is where they fall. So we are going to need a sign right there to make sure that the... Uh, the water doesn't go down there and then we'll need a sign right here and water whoa water right there so they will come up they'll hit this water hopefully come forward and fall on down to their debts and they should be two hit kills at that point so all we need to do now is Fix up this area, I guess. Um, and put the water in down at the bottom, of course. I didn't forget about that. Don't worry. All right. I don't think we need this to be exceptionally large, and certainly not to start out, just to kind of make sure it works before we go crazy. Um, let's do let's do some stone brick. I think. We'll put that like there, there, and there. Oh, but you know what? I kind of want to, hmm. We're going to have to dig some more of this because I want to be able to see what's going on in here. Maybe one on that side and one on this side. See that? So that's going to be weird. But we can always we can always do a little bit of terraforming. That is not a problem. Let's grab uh, our crafting bench over here and make some uh, let's make some slabs. And I think. I think maybe that's all we need right now. I mean, we can do, we can get kind of fancy and stuff with um, iron bars and all that. But honestly, the only thing we really need to be able to do is be able to whack them. Right? <laughs> yes. Um, I think that'll work. I'm not really sure. 
So let's, what we can do is, okay, we need to put the water in here. So that's, that's important. So let's come over to this side first, put some in a corner. Here's a question. Can I just put some in? Oh, do the signs have to be on this level? Interesting. I did not know that. But that'll, that'll work. You're gonna have to go. Oh, does that not work like that? Guess not. They all gotta be going the same way. <laughs> there we go. Okay. And then we can uh, fill this in and let's grab some more water here. There we go. And we'll do this corner and we'll break these guys. And we'll do, can I still reach that? I can't. Excellent, okay. We'll do this corner and we'll break this guy and let's um let's pop on over here break that that one won't be very hard to break at all this one on the other hand there we go i'm not gonna get my torches back in my <laughs> we're not gonna worry about it all right so let's break this and it looks like we already had a, a zombie which is really cool um and i want to use i want to use the cobblestone stone just so that i know where um where our border is so that when we come in here because i want to add like um some redstone lamps and stuff to make it um, so we can turn the farm on and off and whatnot but I want to know where um, where my border is so we're gonna use cobblestone like so and let's come over here and see what's going on I guess um, let's break that why do we have light is it just did I leave a torch down there? Hmm. Okay, so we're gonna have to fix that. Let's put some torches back in here. Okay. And we'll put some here for, for good measure. And drop on down. Right. Okay, so they are getting stuck here. What we can do, I think... I don't have any water, though. Um, what I think we can do is the same thing I was trying to do before. Just put one there. Sign. Here. All right, let's go up. What is that noise? Are they not falling? 
There's oh, I bet I know what it is. Um, let's come down here real quick. Grab a piece of dirt. Oh no! Oh, well, at least we know where my stuff is. So <laughs> let's come in here. And where's the entrance? Over here. Uh, did I get my pick? I did. All right, make sure we got all that. Like so, and then uh, we need some water, right? Put that back on. Oh, why can't you ever pick anything up in the order that you dropped it in? That would be really nice. Okay. Let's go grab some water, which is over here. And go back in there and see if we can't um see if we can't fix it a little bit maybe oh jeez okay let's do um hey Will that work? No. So let's grab a sign. Put it right there. Now does that work? That. That should work. Let's try that. See if they stop getting stuck. Let's eat. I don't want to die again. Okay, they are getting caught on this, so I'm wondering if maybe we need to put it on that side. Let's try that. And see what happens. Uh, I suppose we'll find out. Let's sleep while we wait. Right, it is morning and we still have nothing in there. Why are they getting stuck? That is where I am stuck. So, you know what? Let me, um, hmm. <laughs> I gotta go this way to get up. I always go the wrong way. I go this way to get to the bed and that way to go up to the top. Every time. <laughs> All right, let's come up here and see if we can figure out why they are stuck. I have no idea and I don't want to burn them in the process because I want to see why they're stuck so let's do um I guess we can just use this let's do that so they don't burn So they're getting pushed over there. They're just not. Okay, I see. So they're bouncing in the water. So maybe we need to put the sign um, instead of where it is. What if we put it 
Nope. What if we put it there? See, that's still not going to stop them from... Let's put one there real quick. And drop this down one. Break that. And put it there. Let's try that. Now it does mean that they're gonna have one more block of um of, of damage that they're not taking, but that could just work. Let's give that a try. Oh, why do I do this to myself? <laughs> there we go. Okay, move, piggy. That's safe. You, however, are most definitely not safe. There we go. Okay. Let's see. Ooh! Hello, friends. Alright, so we need to fix the, the XP portion of this because I'm not getting any of that. But, otherwise... Let's see, can we have them land... There, and maybe put... Like that. That should work, right? I don't think the... I don't think the babies can get out of that. Yeah, because it's one and a half blocks. Oh, well, it's one block, but it's a, a half and a half. I don't know if that counts or not. <laughs> it looks like we're getting zombies, which is good. Oh, <gasps> look at you guys. Okay, and I can get the XP out of there, which means, and they're one, not one punch, but one hit with the sword. I wonder if they're getting stuck at all. So there's like a whole bunch of them coming up right there too. That's, that's an improvement. It's taken a while, but it is definitely an improvement. <laughs> let's do, let's do one more. I want to see that chain mail guy come down. Three. Aha. Okay, so it takes a little while, but good news is we have a fully functioning zombie XP farm, which is really, really awesome. And I have no idea. Uh, why the little one sounds like it's dying, um, but I, I was going to say, I have no idea how long this episode is currently running. So I'm going to, um, I'm going to sit here for a little while and, um, do some grinding and see where we're at as far as time while I sit here and let zombies collect to themselves. And I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, everybody, I'm back. And as you can see, we have 33 levels and these guys, I did turn the sound down, so uh, but they pile up here pretty well, and we just, oh, so close. There we go. And we just raking in the levels. And I do think, uh, I know the babies can't get out, but I actually think they're dying down at the bottom. And then I wanted to show you something real quick, and I'm sure you were all uh, horribly shaking your heads at me <laughs> in the last clip. I figured out what to do up here. I was putting the sign... In, in the complete wrong location. 
And I'm sure you were all just like, Kai, no. So I fixed it. It's there now. The water doesn't go into the hole and they just bloop. They just go right on down and we are good to go for that. But um, for, for, for this farm, at least uh, this episode, we're going to call it good. Uh, we'll decorate it in a future episode. I don't know if it'll be the next one or not, but in a future episode, we will decorate it. What I want to do uh, for the very end of this episode, though, is grab some diamonds and grab some sticks and see if we can't get uh, some fortune on a pickaxe. I'm really hoping, oh, I missed, really hoping that we're going to get lucky. So let's come in here and I can actually show you what I did in here. I made it a little bit bigger. And I don't think I've mentioned that in, in a video yet. Um, so I actually added two sets of chests on either side to make it bigger there. And, oh, and I made it one taller too. There just was not enough, not enough space in here before I was going a little bit crazy. Okay. So let's grab this guy and we've got our fortune one on us and let's grab our sticks and let's actually toss uh, just a little bit of this stuff away, I'm thinking. And we can just put this, uh, not the carrots. This. This. Glass. And we can put this and this. Oh, wait, I guess, I guess we'll leave that there. Um, we don't actually need an empty inventory, just a mostly empty inventory. Something that we can work with a little bit. Let's go ahead and hop on over to, to our enchanting area, which is back this way. We still need to work on this whole getting, getting around thing, as you can see. <laughs> it's definitely a, a work in progress and this part is not progressing at all <laughs> we do I did do some stuff with the path over there I think I showed you that I don't know I did it on a stream so we're working on the fields and the path uh, I put some lighting in the ground yeah I showed you this I don't I pretty sure <laughs> it's yeah it's hard to remember what I do in a video when I when I stream this also it gets tough um we do have additional trees up I did three trees so we got three custom trees in here which are looking very nice I think all right let's come in here and let's make, oh, what do we want to do? You know what? I'm, we're just going to go for the pickaxes because we're going to need them anyways. And I did not bring any lapis. All right. I am back and we have the lapis. So let's see what we got. Efficiency four. That's a guaranteed fortune. I don't really want fortune one though, um, but this could be just, I mean, it could be just efficiency. So that gets us a guaranteed fortune two pick, but if this rolls with fortune three, oh, it's such a gamble. Let's, let's, yeah, that is such a bummer. Let's see what we got here. Unbreaking three. Uh, well, if it's just, we can still combine these two and get a pretty good workhorse pick, which is, <laughs> which is what we got. Dang, that is such a bummer. Such a bummer. Um, actually, you know what? Let's not do that yet because we do still have fortune one. So let's, uh, let's find a spot where we can actually put this down. <laughs> And see if we can get maybe three diamonds out of two 
No. I was using... Yeah, I was using the right one. Okay. Let's do another one. And... We do have these. Let's make... Um, let's make one of these for a throwaway. Fortune 2. Level requirement is... 30. Hmm. I don't want fortune two. I think we're just going to leave that, uh, leave that there. I'm going to go ahead and combine these guys and, uh, I'm going to, hmm. I'm gonna go back to to our zombie guy over there and I'm gonna just keep getting levels and coming back and enchanting and until we get what we want I guess and I'll I'll show you what we come up with in the next episode until then I hope you guys enjoyed I hope you have a wonderful rest of the day and I'll see you in the next one bye bye